Hey guys, so I am tuning in from the rooftop of a super cool bar here in Split on my second to last night here, which is so crazy to think about that this first month of our trip is already almost done. Um, it's gone by so fast and yet it feels like it's been months worth of time. Um, and part of why I'm coming in to tune in is one to kind of connect and be like, you know, have a moment of sharing this wonderful moment with you all of, you know, wrapping up this amazing first couple of weeks of this experience, but also to talk a little bit about, um, actually a little bit about what I talked about on my last radio show, which should be airing uh, on Friday. And it was about connection and community and all the things that I've learned about while I've been on this crazy ride so far. Um, and one of the things that I am loving so much is my distance Reiki clients. Um, it's been really, really special. And I was thinking about it today as in terms of connection, because we often think that connection is either face to face or it's, you know, over the phone. And it's sometimes hard to even fathom how connection can be global and can just be energy you know like I was so skeptical of distance Reiki when I first started getting into Reiki I was like there's no way that that could be possible there's no way that that could work and of course after five years of doing it and teaching it I was proven wrong time and time again um, and having people kind of test the waters of distance Reiki over the past few days, uh, actually a few weeks really, has been so magical. Both, hi Jen Jen! Um, it's been really magical. Like, you know, just as magic as me coming on live in Croatia, seeing one of my best friends Jen popping up on the screen and Stephanie. Uh, you know, like, connection is possible across so many different planes, um, which sounds totally wacky, but like, Essentially, you know, we can't see electromagnetic waves, we can't see radio waves, and yet we know that they're there. Sorry about the construction in the background. Um, so it, it's stretching the corners of our mind in terms of what we think is possible to open up to all different ways of connection, uh, which is really grounding and really beautiful for me because while I'm here, I, it, it's an also a really sweet way for me to get to connect with all these people that I love so much. <laughs> um, thanks, Matthew. <laughs> and I, what I love about it is like, I get to not just connect, you know, over text or not just connect over a phone call, but like on a really beautiful, deep, intimate level with people. Like the Reiki takes people into their soul. It takes people into their spirit, which there's so many yummy messages in there for you. So uh, I've been really, really loving that distance Reiki. And if it's something that you're like curious about or wanna try, I promise you it's like, I prom it's like magic. It's like magic. Like a really cool, very real kind of magic. <laughs> Um, just like the fact that I'm coming to you live from the rooftop of a bar in Croatia, uh, that's also kind of magic. Um, so if you're curious about what it might look like to do a little bit of, uh, deep connection over the crossing time and space, shoot out, uh, and send me a message, uh, or... Honestly, send me a brainwave and see if I get it. <laughs> it was like, good, let's get way out there and wacky. Um, but really, honestly, like I, I would love to connect and support you and do some magic across the globe. Um, and then the also the other thing I was thinking about is uh, the Feminine Rising Women's Group Coaching that I'm doing. And I was also really skeptical, skeptical about um, group coaching, especially because it's virtual. And I was like, how is that going to land when you're virtual and people can kind of like space out and not really be engaged? And I did one for myself uh, with a mastermind group the past six months and it was so awesome. 
you know, like these women who I've never actually met in person and live all over the country and yet I feel really connected to them. So essentially what I'm talking about is finding ways to get deeply connected to people that may be a little outside of the box, like may not be having to see someone in person like your mom or your grandmother or your friend you know like there's still so many avenues for connecting really deeply with people that you know basically it, the it's the intuition or the yes it's the intuition but it's the intention with which you give it the energy with which you give it that allows it to be like super fulfilling and authentic and deep um, or not you know so <sighs> loving this connection thank you Glenn that's really sweet um, I'm loving connecting to you guys I'm loving bringing you into my world which feels so super surreal at the moment hi Karen um, if you want to connect on a deeper level if you're looking for a little bit of love and healing I'm always here and always super excited to share with people Ray oh I love it do you guys see this amazing view? Yeah. Pretty incredible. All right. Lots and lots and lots of love. If you're looking for a little magic, reach out. Um, if you're a woman, there's only four spots open for Feminine Rising and we begin in the middle of May. So uh, if you're looking to kind of expand and grow into the really big dreams that you're looking for, totally reach out oh stephanie ray sending you so much love i love you guys if you have questions if you're looking for some connection you know where to go always looking to love on you guys always 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 okay Mwah. adieu enjoy this beautiful view <laughs> I know. It's crazy. Okay. Love you guys. Have an amazing evening.